Welcome to the chapel at Eagle's Wings. Um, we have been waiting for this day for some years now, and we finally have walls up. And so I want to take you inside and show you a bit about what this building's going to look like. As we come into the building, um, you'll look toward the stage. There'll be chairs on both sides here. Um, here we have a, a bathrooms. Um, there'll be a little kitchen over here. This over here is an office. They're working on the office wall now. Okay, yep. going up. Nice and easy. Okay, fun part about this. So office finally will have an administration thing where people can actually drive up and actually come into an actual office. And so registration, if you have range, doesn't have to be out on the picnic table. So along with everything else, so much moves in out of the rain. Of course, we got people holding the wall, so we'll screw it on. And then the fun part about this building is you see there's three big glass doors and those three glass doors will give a good view out toward the campsite as well as be a really easy way to bring in a lot of kids in a short period of time. And then uh, Maria, Dwayne are on the stage here and you can see there'll be another little room over here that will hold um, things like instruments and sound equipment. Hey, hello, I'm Mike Keppela. I'm actually uh, from the United States of America, from South Carolina, and we are here helping with the uh, camp to be able to set up the new chapel that will eventually hold students to be able to learn what it means to love Jesus, to be able to know Jesus, and to be able to connect with other people as well. So this week, we are three different churches that are represented. One, a church from Dallas, Texas. One from Malden First Baptist Church, which is in Greenville, South Carolina. And then also Brookwood Church in Greenville, South Carolina. And so there's 11 of us coming with very little skill, but we have learned so much this week about what it means to be able to utilize these tools and uh, really help to build and grow and develop what uh, God wants to do here in this area. And Tallis, Tallis, one of the best um, contractors in the world, especially in Latvia. I mean, international, international, international general contractor. Amazing, amazing. He's he's done amazing. There, go for it. See what you got. And that's Yeah, okay. Well watch your head. Watch watch your head there, yeah. So I'm Talis Hunter Wormert. Been uh, been working in Latvia at Eagles Wings for the past 10, 10 years or so, since 2014. Started out with just tents and now we're building a chapel that's 25 meters by 15 meters big. And it's really cool to see what God has done for the camp and seeing how much has grown through, uh, through Americans and Dutch and British people, a ton of different churches all over the world. And this is where we are. So, uh, just a lot of work to keep on going. And if anybody knows what construction's like, you just can't stop. Just gotta keep going. It's just a lot of hard work, but it's fun. It's really cool to see it come together with a big crew. So, we made it a long way. We got four walls up. I'm, I'm nailing these, I'm bolting these walls down. And the reason they're so long is because we use a, a really like a, a dry laid cement and I'm trying to get all the way down to our big blocks. So we're trying to actually build, build strong and that'll last. That's the whole goal here. Build something that lasts. Hello, my name is uh, Dimitris Dix-Bordikos. I am 
Eagle's Wings director and you are now at Eagle's Wings. And uh, why are we making this video? Because there is lots and lots of people working and what they're doing, they're building chapel. Tal has been doing a great job since he uh, moved to Latvia. He loves Latvia just like I do. Many, many years ago when we started to do the uh, summer camps, it was only in the tents. Who been thinking that we are going to build a chapel? It's amazing. So during those uh, 20 years of camps, our camps been growing so much. Uh, now we have uh, eight camps in the summer season. And recently we had a fall camp totally his. And it was interesting, this was the biggest camp fall camp since we start doing the camps. We understand we need to build something bigger. And the, the great thing, the chapel was built with a team from the South Carolina and, and Texas, thanks to Bridge Builders International who brought the team. When the Bridge Builders team left, then we, we are blessed and we got Christmas Valley Church uh, team coming here. So now they're working on uh, putting up the trusses. All total, they need to put 42 trusses. How far you are now, Dwight? How many trusses you already? Uh, we've got seven, I believe. So, so all total 42, right? Yeah, it's only 35 more. Oh, just 30. Good. Good. good job. Thank you, good. Dwight. Thank you. So today we had Christmas Valley group show up. Um, these guys are not new to Eagle's Wings. In fact, they worked on the first cabin and the lodge and the barn and the third cabin. Um, so we have all the walls up and now the trusses are going up and that's something that they are quite good at. So uh, we're looking forward to getting the trusses so that we can put the roof on. And um, this is the first sunny day we've had in a month. And so we're really excited about that. And we hope to get a roof on before it starts raining or maybe snowing again. Uh, so yeah, these guys, um, their heart is here and it's uh, very exciting to have them back.